Hello, COVID-19. Billions of your fellow agents have invaded Earth, but intel reveals that humans are onto us. This video introduces our infection protocol and their arsenal of weapons. Your small size makes you invisible, so you can travel on droplets inhaled into lungs. Equipped with spike proteins, you will dock onto a cell surface receptor called ACE2 to invade and hijack the cell's factories to clone yourself. Build your army by targeting ACE2 rich organs to multiply exponentially. Despite our best efforts at staying under the radar, in some humans, our propagation causes coughing, GI symptoms, loss of smell and taste, and high fevers. So your cover is blown. Humans have security measures against us. Production of immune messengers called cytokines is increased to gear up for battle. A rapid response system deploys white blood cells to devour us. Next, an army of specialized cells custom make antibodies to neutralize us. These boosted responses last until we're squashed and then fall to routine levels in case we attack again. Occasionally, these responses get carried away and too many inflammatory cytokines are made. Like a runaway train with no brakes, this cytokine storm creates a trail of destruction. A cascade of events leads to serious complications like blood clots and leaky vessels, which in turn cause strokes, respiratory, heart and kidney failure, or even death. In trying to kill us, the human ravages his own body. This is good for no one. If humans die, we go back to infecting bats, and I just can't go back there again. Lately, humans have stepped up efforts to eradicate us, making your mission much riskier. Potential threats. Humans are washing hands, wearing masks, and social distancing to help flatten the curve. These measures slow our spread and lessen the surge in sick hosts competing for limited medical resources. Importantly, they buy time for scientists to develop preventive strategies like vaccines. These are weakened versions or pieces of us given to healthy humans so that their immune systems will be trained to recognize and destroy us in future invasions. COVID vaccines don't exist yet, so you're safe for now. Humans are trying these therapies, so look out for the following. Plasma donated from COVID survivors have antibodies that target you for destruction, providing humans quick but short-lived immunity from us. If you run into these foes, mutate by swapping out spike proteins to not get caught. Antiviral drugs block your cloning process. Cytokine receptor blockers intercept pro-inflammation orders to help save organs. Your host might live only to become a future plasma donor. As you can see, this mission has a microscopic chance of success. Why? Because humans are smart, resilient, and not your average apes. Good luck.